Brittany and Cole, have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? I uh, have. Are you prepared as you follow the path of marriage to love and honor each other for as long as you shall both live? I am. Are you prepared to accept children lovingly from God and bring them up according to the law of Christ and His church? I am. Um, since it is your intention to enter the covenant of holy matrimony, join your right hands and declare your consent before God and His church. Last summer when I received a phone call from Cole who said he was going to quote unquote <laughs> drop the hammer on Brittany. I'm not entirely sure what this meant but I quickly learned that Cole and Brittany are about to spend the rest of their lives together. I hope that you are devoted as a husband as you are a Cornhusker football fan. Brittany, you wear Husker red in the fall on Saturdays. You laugh uncontrollably at all the stupid things our family says and does. Specifically, Mark McAllister's jokes which really aren't that funny, let's be honest. You, you have also laughed so hard that you snort like a pig. Yes, you did do this. You could start a conversation with a stranger, literally anyone. And lastly, most importantly, you're an extremely kind and caring person. Sheila, I said, you know, this kid is really sensitive. This is really impressive. Somebody that's wanting to get married that, that bad. And six months into it, four months into it, he keeps calling me. He says, God, I'm so excited about the big day. So last Thursday, he calls me and says, Kevin, guess what? 23 more days. Now, I know Cole's from Iowa, but I, I, I know he, he could count. But it was Saturday, he's getting married. And he's calling me on Thursday and said, 23 more days, Kev. And I said, Cole, what are you talking about? He goes, till the Huskers' first home game. So I knew right then. You know, I've been blessed with a great, another great son-in-law, and I, and I tell you what, when, I, when Cole said that, I said, you know, this kid's a, he's a kindred spirit, he's after my heart, so I was, I was pretty excited about that. I Cole take you, Brittany, to be my wife. I Cole take you, Brittany, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. Good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and honor you. To love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Brittany, take you cold to be my husband. I, Brittany, take you cold to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and honor you. To love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Brittany is uh, a pretty special girl to Sheila and I. It's obviously Sheila's daughter, and uh, we couldn't be happier for her. She's found, she found the right guy. We're so, we're so proud of you. We couldn't be more proud of you. And she does sell, she does sell real estate. 
She sold about 50 houses this year, so anybody wants to, I got to put a plug in for that deal. She's been very productive, and as Sheila hopes that she'll see in the next uh, year or so, that she, as productive as she is, she's kind of hoping she becomes reproductive. I want to welcome Brittany to the family. Cole, uh, Cole always has been pretty lucky, and uh, this is no exception. Uh, and I don't know if everybody knows it, but uh, those kids were born about an hour apart on the same day. Uh, so typically, you would think they'd age about the same, but I think Cole's going to start aging a lot faster now. Thank you guys so much for being here. We're very excited, so have fun. You know, like my brother said, all the beer is on my old man, so please take advantage. Have fun tonight. little sister comes with some added perks. She has a smile that can light up just about any room she walks into, and she gets along with literally everybody that she meets. I have a best friend for life. On top of that, when my special day comes around, I have somebody to stand next to me. And now a new awesome added perk is that I am also Cole's little sister. I'm excited to be able to call myself Cole's little sister, and it's an honor to be your guy's little sister. So now, Cole, I hope you're ready for the lifetime ahead of being called Brittany's husband. What a blessed day. Uh, the union of marriage with Cole and Brittany, and giving away my daughter was difficult. Uh, it's tough, but uh, he, she's in good hands. I believe uh, Cole will take care of her. If not, we'll take care of Cole. You are someone I've always figuratively and physically looked up to. I hope someday I have a son who is half the person you are. I can't imagine life without you as my brother and my pal, for there is no buddy like a brother. I love you guys and I wish the absolute best for you. 
I want to share a quote with you that I thought was very suitable for these two on their special day. Marriage isn't about finding the person you can live with. No, that's too easy. Marriage is about finding someone you cannot live without. Cole and Brittany have together found that person they can't live without.